Okay. The system comes with functionality to clean in place, or CRP. And what this is, is it, it's basically, if you don't want to send your membranes in to get reconditioned, you can actually do it yourself. Uh, it is a little tricky and it does take a bit of time, but basically the only extra components you need is a separate pump and a separate little tank. Um, what you would want to clean is, for example, if you have bacteria contamination or biological contamination, you would use a biocide flush across the membrane. If you just have salt content building up on the membrane, you could use low mineral content water to dissolve it. Or if you have scaling from hardness build up on the membrane, you can use anti-scaling to flush, flush through the membrane. In effect, what you do is you close off the entire system um, to the normal, normal functioning units and you bypass everything and put water into the membrane and take it out of the product and out of the drain water straight back into a different tank. How you'd connect that to the system is this is your source water side. So we'd close off the valve completely coming from the high pressure pump and then you'd open the CRP valve and your, your small pump would pump into here into the membranes and then on, uh, on the, <coughs> the product water side here you've got a valve for CRP for, to get the product water for the CRP and again you'd close off this valve which goes to your normal flow meter and product water and open this one and then on, on the other side we've got the, the wastewater side. So you'd open this valve, you'd manually close the solenoid and you would clo close the recycling valve and the wastewater valve um, both. Then in, in effect you've got a completely closed loop system and you can just circulate the same liquid through and through and through and through and through with the, with the extra pump. Um, and that's, that's how you clean the membranes. What's very important is empty it, flush it very thoroughly with, with clean water again. Um, okay, if it's with just the low mineral content flush, then it's not important, but if it's anti-scalant or biocide, you really don't want to drink that. So before you connect it up to run to your normal um, water supply, make sure you've flushed it thoroughly.